Okay, so uh, here I am in my 2004 Yukon Denali, and I've got a little problem with the ABS. The uh, traction control will kick on and give me a stability error. Kind of frustrating when you're just starting off. It'll pick back up again if you're going faster, but. Uh, you got to turn it off if you want to pull into traffic. So we got ourselves here a Millennium 90 Pro. And uh, I'm going to show you how to get into the wheel speed sensors so you can determine whether or not your uh, which, which sensor is faulty. So I'm going to start by plugging this thing into the OBD2 sensor. Then you're going to turn on the key. There you're going to see that we're almost 200,000 miles on this old truck, but running great. So we're going to choose Diagnose. Press the OK button down here. Okay. Quite enough light in here for that. Okay, I'm going to do the arrow key, and you're going to go and do scan. Say okay. You have to find your vehicle. Click OK. I'm going to do diagnose. V12.50, whatever that means. manually select apparently it's not smart enough to find which kind of truck I got here oops there 2004 and this is a medium duty truck GMC truck through trial and error we found out that we are a B-W4 series now we're going to look at the chassis here, not the powertrain. And we want the data display. And bingo. There they all are. Now you're going to have to have somebody else drive or somebody else read these displays. And then as you start off from a stop, you're going to see one of these just hang up for just a second before it picks up to the other wheel sensors. So once you find out what that is, in this case it's my left front, you just usually have to take that all apart, clean it, clean the rust off it because it's usually just pulled away from the sensor just a tiny amount to cause this little disruption in the field so good luck god bless